Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Okay, so I have had a few requests on nail art barriers and which ones I like to use, etc. So I have used a few of these in my videos, um, namely the stamping videos. So what I'm gonna do today is demo all four on my nails and see how they hold up during stamping, how easy they are to apply and how easy they are to remove from the skin. So if you're interested, then just stay tuned. So first up we have Make It Messy and this is a latex free barrier from Steel City Reflections. So it comes in this sort of what I like to call a lip gloss style packaging. So you have a wand there with it on. So I'm just going to apply this. So this was really easy to apply, but the only thing I found was I couldn't get enough product on the wand. I had to keep dipping it back into the tube. But other than that, it was pretty easy to apply. So next up we have a peel off base coat. This, so this is used for things like under glitter polish, etc. And this is in the brand Miss Sporty. So this was a lot easier to apply because obviously you have a brush applicator and you could get as much or as little as you wanted on that brush. So this was really easy. Next up we have Zap, which is the only one that contains latex and this was super easy to apply. The brush is slightly thinner than the other one. Um, the only thing I will say is obviously it is latex so it does have that ammonia smell to it but that doesn't bother me. And then lastly we've got the NYC Strip Me Off, again it's another peel off base coat and you've probably seen me use this in previous videos. And this is really easy to apply. So all these are sort of dry clear when they're ready to use. Okay, so I'm not going for any particular design here. I'm just going to stamp this image randomly and then I am going to stamp on the skin on purpose so we can see how well that barrier holds up. Okay, so on to removal. So this is the first one that I applied, Steel City Reflections Make It Messy. And as you can see, it's actually coming off in bits. When I remove my barriers, I like them to come off in more or less one piece because it's just less faffing. So this one came off in pieces. So this is the Miss Sporty Peel Off Base Coat and I was really pleased with how this one came off. It just literally peeled off in one piece. And then Zap, the latex barrier, this obviously is sort of turns to rubber latex. So it did just come off in one piece as well. And then the NYC Strip Me Off base coat, this came off in a couple of pieces. Okay, so they all pretty much did their job and they were really easy to apply. The only snag is when it comes to removal, I like it just to be quick and easy and whip them off. So I prefer the Zap. But obviously this contains latex, so if you are allergic to latex, you're possibly better off with the peel-off 
base coats but I will leave links to all these products in the description box so hope you found this video useful guys and I'll see you in the next one bye